Well, hello, everybody. My name is J.S. Matthews. Welcome back to Seven Days Die. Man, I will tell you, looting at night with everything just sprinting at you is absolutely terrifying. So that's fun. Yeah, I just kind of <laughs> spent my night doing a little bit of looting there. Grabbed some stuff. You know what? Come to think of it, uh, we, have a, we have about an hour before the trader goes up, or two, two hours, I think, in game. Let's go ahead and throw some stuff in here that we don't need, because I'm going to sell this crap anyways. So... I think that's about it. Do I even... Uh, basic light bulb. Well, 15? Okay, you know what? Maybe we'll hang on to that. But yeah, I did just find this. That's pretty nice. Nice little iron pickaxe. Let's go ahead and throw that over here. I am going to sell this one. 
So not super worried about it. I don't know. Let's just leave it in our inventory. Not a big deal. Let's go ahead and eat this uh, eat this cat food real quick. And we'll just scrap that up. Now we got a little more room. That's okay. Do a little more looting. But we'll do a little bit more looting and head over to uh, the trader then. Let's go ahead and see if we can be nice and quiet through this place. I don't know why I'm using the crossbow. <laughs> nice. I will have to say, I really like this bow. Oh, I heard somebody. Oh. <laughs> nice. Man, the headshots are just awesome. If you can get the headshots, you're pretty good. If you miss the headshot, though, it's definitely, it gets a little scary there. Let's see what's in the toilet. Any more pistol? I would love to have another pistol in a toilet. That would be totally fine. Especially if it's like a level 5 one. I would take that. Maybe, uh... No, I already have a Magnum. That would be good, though. I wouldn't mind having some more Magnum ammo. Uh, anything in here? Anybody? Nope. Oh, gosh. I can't hear anything because of that stupid uh, storm outside. The other thing is, I really gotta start wearing headphones while playing this game. <laughs> I gotta start wearing headphones, period, actually. I don't know why I don't. So they're a little uncomfortable, I guess. Oh! Whoa! Okay. We'll head down there in a little bit. Anybody in there? Oh, yes, sir. Got you. Oh, hey, we got three skill points to spend. That is awesome. Let's go ahead and grab this food here, see what we got. Eh, beer, that sells. We'll take that. And I heard that. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh, gosh. What? Well, uh, climb. Come on. Swim. Oh, my gosh. That's terrifying. Okay, so now we are underground. Cool. Awesome. Okay. Wow, that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Do we have any frames now? You know what? We're going to go through this the intended way. Let's go ahead and go through this basement area. I was going to say, wow, this is a really easy area. This is super chill. No, no, it is not. All right, let's keep going here. Let's see. We're just going to go the regular way. I could probably climb out of here, but I kind of want to see what's down here. Also, I'm a little terrified of it. Last time I was in a cave like this, it was full of a giant boar. Oh, yep. Woo! Where are you, lady? Whoa. Come on. There we go. Whew. Man, when they start sprinting, holy crap, I got to keep this shotgun out. That's what I really got to do. Um, are these worth much? Nah, just 10. I'm just going to leave them. I don't care. All right, let's keep going here. Let's see what else is in this house. I need to go loot that kitchen again. Oh, hey. Oh, that was it, huh? Oh, interesting. Okay. I already opened that up. Let's see what else is uh, in here, though. Can I search this stuff? Yeah, we got some uh, charred meat. You know, I'm just going to use that and just drink those waters, too. Why not? Clear up my inventory a little bit. All right, not much in here. Hoop. Anything else over here? Oh, so it's just covered. I can grab my arrow again, actually, too. Yeah, you know what? We're just going to drink him. Let's grab this arrow, and we're going to head up the stairs, then. Let's see what's up here. Keep the shotgun out, though. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Oh, shoot. Let's go in here. Okay, oh my gosh, that door's not going to hold for long. Reload. Let's do this. Come on, where are you? Oh, my gosh, there's three. Ready? Woo! That was, that was pretty smooth, if I do say so myself. Hey, it's 6 o'clock. We can head over to the trader. Let's just grab this loot here. Oh, that's some good stuff. Nice. And let's see what's upstairs. Okay, we are encumbered. Let's just try to get to the end of this loot thing. See if there's anything else we can find. Um, let's check the open doors first, just in case anything's in here. Uh, half a person. Yeah, nobody in there. All right. Ooh, hey, that'll be a good sell price. Yep, 130. We are gonna take that. That is worth it. These are not worth really anything. We're just gonna drop those. Well, the recog sells for a lot, and I don't really use it. <laughs> I have like seven of them sitting back in my back in my base. Let's leave that closed for now, because I think they all came from these three areas. Maybe. Let's see what's up in here. We're just gonna drink that again. Whatever. We're fine. <laughs> we don't have to worry about water right now, huh? Um. Anybody else in here? Anything else? Nope. Okay, I don't need that cobble. I don't mind. That is kind of a cool little attic. That's pretty sweet. I wish I had one of those in my house. I'd turn it into a room. So oh, hey, we'll sell that. That's 50. All right, we'll take it. 
Anything else around here? Oh, you know what? Toilet pistol. Oh, give me a nice regular pistol upgrade. Nope. Nope. Just some toilet water. Alright. Let's see what's in here. Oh, there's a hole in the wall, which probably means... Something's good. Oh, yep. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, my gosh. I did not see that guy coming. There we go. We'll take him out. Oh, man. Whew. I did, I did not realize he came out of that... Uh... Came out of that closet. Man, now they're, they're sprinting. Holy crap, this is way, this is way tougher. Oh, hey, there's a guy. Let's take him out. Many of these guys we take out before they start running at us, the better. Come on, just let me in through. Let me through. Anybody on this side? Nope. Somebody going to fall on my head? Probably, right? No? Nothing? Huh, okay, interesting. Let's grab our arrow here. Oh, hey, attic, okay. I was like, there's got to be something else around here. Oh, we got some, oh, hey, worth 100. I'll take those. What we got in here, what are you worth? Hundred. Wait, how much is that? 160. Holy crap, those books are worth a lot. What can we drop here that we don't need? I mean, most of the stuff I'm selling, ah, I don't really need the dirty water. I got. I got plenty of stuff. We're fine. Keep the dukes for now. Uh, the light bulbs were 15. If we have to drop anything, we're going to drop that. Or these. I'll just start drinking these up. Um, Anything else? Let's check in here real quick. Anything up here? Ooh, ammo. Yep, that's what I want. Jeez, I can jump so high now. I can't even can't even see what I want to get. Oh, we'll just take those shotgun shells. Don't need the buckshot. I'm fine. I can just buy shotgun shells right now. I think I have so many. Really not worried about it. Although that's when you start running out, right? Okay. Let's go ahead and take our shotgun here. Let's see what's up here. You know somebody's coming over this way. Yep, there they Oh, see? That's weird. They just like spawn in. Okay, got her. Whoa! Run down. Whoa! Cop! Okay, okay, okay. Close that door. Get our shotgun ready. Where's that cop? Oh, there he is. Oh gosh, he's exploding. Run! Oh, man! He blew the whole door out. Oh, he almost blew you up too, huh? Nice. Okay, that worked out all right. <laughs> Holy cow. I gotta start putting down... Uh, I gotta start building some hatches and putting those down. Uh, I think Glock9 does that really well on his channel. Just throw down a hatch and just start banging away at him. Repair it up. Whew! Okay, that went well. Hey, what's in here? Some trash, huh? What do we got? Uh, aloe seed. I don't really... You know, we'll take the wood just because. I mean, we can. Might as well. Let's see what's in here, and then we'll head over to the trader. Sweet. All right, well, we're ended up with some pretty good stuff. Let's go ahead and get rid of the glue. Not really worried about that right now. Yeah, let's get rid of the glue. I guess I could have gotten rid of the leather, too. But that's okay, instead of the glue. But we're fine. We're fine. Let's go ahead and head over to the trader now. And let's get out of here. We'll go sell some stuff, see what else we got. See if we can get another job, huh? So I'll see you when we get there. All right, here we are. I got to remember, I still have some stuff to sell on the bike, too. So let's go ahead and sell all this stuff. Let's see what they got. And I think by the end, uh, once we start doing Horde Night every night, I think we might actually make our way to a new city. Just kind of make it different. Maybe we'll head that way. Check out that city. Let's sell some stuff, though. All right, so most of the stuff I don't want. Let's see if there's anything else that we actually do want here. Any armor? Nah, everything's just scrap. I don't want that. Man, I really need to buy uh, the better barterer perk. See if we can get some better stuff in here. And we got a military helmet. I think we... I don't even know if we have one yet. And we got a level 3 pistol, but that's not worth it. Really isn't worth it. All right, I think we're good to go. No, uh... No more motorcycles still. Dang. Oh, it's uh, day 15, so this is a horde night. Oh, man, I forgot about that. <laughs> I've been playing this for, like, a couple days. I'm only putting out one a week. Uh, the reason why is it takes a while to edit them. It takes a while to play them and stuff. Uh, but then on top of that, I'm also doing a bunch of other different videos. I'm doing Minecraft. I started doing some Ghost Recon ones. Uh, those should be up by now as well. But, yeah, I'm kind of trying to balance my time here because I am a dad and I do have kids and... I do have a wife who's pretty awesome, so I enjoy hanging out with her. So trying to balance all that is, uh, yeah, it's a bit of work trying to also run a YouTube channel, but we'll see how it goes. Anyways, let's go ahead and dump some of this stuff, get organized, and then, uh, 
I need to get a new job to do, and I need to find a new place for Horde Night. What am I doing? I don't need a job. We need to figure out Horde Night. All right, got my inventory sorted, and I uh, realized there's a few more things I need to sell. Forgot to take the stuff out of the bike first, but second of all, I think what we might do today, actually, before Horde Night, is just head on out and run up to uh, that other city and see if they have anything good in the in the trader. Might actually be worth it. Maybe we'll just do Horde Night up there. I don't know. I wanted to maybe do it at that construction site, that construction site POI that we did. I think that'd be kind of fun. So maybe we'll sell this stuff. We'll head on over to that construction site and take a look at it. And then maybe next time we'll head up to that city if we survive. I certainly hope we do. Uh, things are going to be uh, pretty wild, I think. Especially with uh, jumping off that thing. <laughs> should be pretty cool. It should be pretty acrobatic, at least. All right. Well, not really much I want to get. I want to see if you had some uh, Magnum ammo. I decided to grab my Magnum, so this is going to be for Horde Night. That should be pretty helpful. We'll see how it goes. But I say we head up to this other place real quick, see if there's anything all the way in this other town, and see if there's anything good over there. We got a, uh, oh, oops, I'm not facing the right way there. We got to we gotta drop. That is way down this way. So we're going to go save waypoint. We're just going to put next there right now. We'll just go drop in that direction. That's fine. Waypoint. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I was like, I thought I heard some footsteps behind me. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can find this trader. I can't remember where the heck the trader is. Is it over this way? Uh, I can't remember. Let me check the map, and we'll see if we can figure this out. Especially those zombies chase me constantly. Um, I think, isn't, isn't this it? Is that it? Let's head over there. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. <laughs> I <just had> to <laughs> All I do is literally look to the left. Like I just got a little, uh, a little mixed up there. It's all right. We're good. Okay. Let's head on in here. Let's see. Oh, please give me a motorcycle lady, please. Come on. Come on. You know, you want to give me a motorcycle. If she has a motorcycle. I'm going to be I very, so very happy. Let's see what she's got. All right, well, unfortunately, no motorcycle, just a motorcycle handlebars, I think, or something like that. So, unfortunately, we are still stuck with our bike. Let's go ahead and throw our Dukes in there. I did get some advanced bellows, though, so we'll throw those into our into our forge when we head back. But really, honestly, so far, man, today's turned out to be a big bummer. Let's head on back, and I think what we're going to do is we're going to head on back and head over to the construction site, and that's what we're going to do for our horde night. I think we'll be running around on there and kind of jumping off of it, jumping between the different levels, and hopefully we can confuse their pathing and just kind of pick them off a little bit. At least that's the goal. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I think doing a horde night and something like this would be kind of fun too, jumping between the houses. That'd be pretty cool. Maybe we'll come up here and do our next horde nights in this, uh, this little city here. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Maybe we'll just turn this into like a, just kind of a traveling sort of uh, <laughs> traveling experience. We'll see how it goes, but right now I'm going to head on back to my base, drop this stuff off, and then go get ready for Horde Night, and hopefully, hopefully there will be uh, another day. I think after this one, though, I think it's Horde Night every night now, according to the rules I've set, so day 15, yeah, I think is this was three days between Horde Nights, so now it goes all the way down to one, and we're going to be doing Horde Night every single night from here on out. So I'll see you when we get back to the base once we get everything situated. And uh, we'll go ahead and get ready for uh, get ready for tonight. All right, so hit up the base. Got kind of everything sorted out. Got those advanced bellows put in. Hopefully they'll actually be helping us here as long as we don't die. <laughs> but let's go ahead and head on over towards this uh, construction site. I think it's over this way. We'll spend some time finding it real quick. Got everything I needed. Got some food, some coffee, 
And I uh, even took out my AK-47. I got a level 4 AK-47. So we'll see how that goes down. That's going to be like our, ah, uh, crap. You know, if things really get bad, we're going to whip that guy out and just start unloading on some people. You know, we'll save it for some cops and stuff. See how that works out. But let's go ahead and mosey on over this way. Let's just take a look at this. Uh, let's take a look at this construction site here and just kind of figure out what we can do with this place. I'm going to leave my bike right down here. Now, my bike does have my food in it, so I might actually take that out. Let's go ahead and just grab my food out. Why not? Whatever. We'll put our we'll put our little shovel in there. Okay, just make sure. Oh, see, wolf. I was like, let's make sure nothing's around here. There's a wolfie. Let's take him out. Oh, whoops. Oh, gosh. Jump! Where are you, wolf? There you are. Hey, there we go. Not bad. I was getting a little scared there. I thought he was one of those bigger ones. <laughs> those guys look like dire wolves. Oh man, those things are those things are huge. Uh, let's go ahead and drop this. I actually just started watching. Uh, I think it's Neebs Gaming's new uh, new Seven Days to Die playthrough. I think uh, two of them ran into a big wolf. They're doing like a bunch of different stuff. I think they're doing like some sort of competition. It was pretty cool. It was good good episode. I love those guys. Um, all right. So first of all, we can whoa. We can start down here, and then we can work our way up, depending on... Let's finish these guys off. Wow, dang, you take some damage, huh? Big guy. There we go. All right, stop sneaking here. Let's grab what we want, grab our arrows back. But yeah, I think we're going to start down here and see how many different things we can run and jump off of. We can run up here, jump. I don't know if they can get up here. Let's go ahead and see if we can finish this guy off too. Why not? Oh, and we gotta spend our points. That's the next thing we're gonna do. Spend our spend our points. If we can keep him at least away for a while, I think this is gonna be a good spot for a horde night tonight. Let's go ahead and finish this guy off. Oh dang. There we go. Alright, so this is kind of where we're gonna do it. So we have a lot of options here. See how many areas I can use parkour to my advantage. That's really what I'm looking for. I can even jump up here and then jump up on this thing and jump up a level. Oh, hey, look, there's a there's a crate here I didn't even get. Let's make sure there's no zombies up here, by the way, just in case. Make sure we've cleared everything out. Don't need anything falling on our heads in the middle of Horde Night. But, yeah, I think this is going to be this is gonna be the spot. We'll be able to pick some stuff off, and we'll start at the bottom, work our way up, and just see if they can chase us up. And if they start tearing it down, oh, well, we'll just kind of start. We'll just do what we can. And if we end up, end up jumping up this building or who knows what, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I should have an escape route, come to think of it. So if we, if, if this whole thing, I, I don't think they could tear through all of this in one night, right? Right? That's the famous last words, right? Um, let's see. Hang on. Let's jump up here. Let's just kind of take a look around here and just make sure. Yeah, this is so, there's no way. I'll be good. Yeah, I can just run over to this side. Then look how many supports this has. And that's all concrete and steel. Oh, yeah. I think we'll be just fine. Oh, hey, there's a dog down there. We're going to take that thing out. I do not need any doggos sneaking up on me. Where are you, sir? Is that an army guy? Oh, it is. Oh, I missed him. Dang it. See the, the pathing? I'm hoping the pathing just gets messed up the entire night. Wow, really? I missed that? There we go. Give him in the head. Give him in the head. There we go. Nice. So, let's see what else. Oh, we got to take that dog out. I was like, what else did I want to get? Oh, there's a dog. And there's another big fat guy over there. Man, these guys are just, like, everywhere. Let's see if we can get this dog, though. Oh, really? Really? Did you see how he dropped right at the last second there? Where's that doggy? Come on, doggy. There we go. Okay, come on, come on. Oh, man, really? Come on, jump up here. One more shot. Come on, where are you? There we go. I'll take that. Dude, I hate the dogs in this game. Oh, whoa. Come on, jump up. No, we're gonna... Just gonna stay sneaking. Let's try to take this fat guy out. And then we gotta spend our points. We're gonna head up there and spend our points. We'll be good. There we go. Good shot. Get him again. And one more. Come on, finish him up. Oh, no, that didn't kill you. This should right here, huh? There we go. All right, so this is where we're going to spend Horde Night. I'll spend some time just kind of uh, checking out the area, looting a little bit, and uh, 
We're gonna get ready for Horde Night. We'll see how this goes. Everything's kind of sprinting at me now, I think, and uh, should be uh, should be exciting at least. Again, no base. Uh, this is our base. Is this POI right here? This is it. That's all we get. So <laughs> we'll see how it works out. I'll see you guys uh, when Horde Night starts up. everybody here we are we are about four minutes from the beginning of horde night and uh, I think I'm about as ready as I can be go ahead and down some coffee drop this guy here oh, that drains my water yeah right now let's wait oh there we go here comes the first one I don't really need to be sneaking I guess huh let's go ahead and see how long we can hold them off for that lady. Well, there's going to be a lot of them coming, I think. What is right below me? Oh, dogs. I hate the dogs. Gotta watch those guys. Oh, here they come. They're coming around. I think they know how to get up here. Oh. Oh, man. <laughs> They're busting through now. They're just going to be hitting down here. Oh gosh. Okay, let's move a little bit here. Let's see what we can do. I don't even know if they can get up here. I thought they could. Oh, come on. Oh, maybe I, maybe I blew something up that could get up here. <laughs> oh, I don't like those dogs being down there. I like being able to run if I need to. Oh gosh. Here they come. Oh, see those baby? Run. Oh, phew. Okay. <laughs> let's jump up here. Here we go, just slowly retreat. Okay, now they're down and down here. Come on. Oh, missed him.
All right, well, that went better than uh, I thought it did. <laughs> I thought it was going to go. Uh, not too bad. I got knocked down by a bird at one point. That pretty much scared the crap out of me. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and clear these guys out. Oh, my gosh, there are a lot down there. We're going to have to try to clear these guys out here. I'm out of uh, AK-47 ammo. Didn't bring enough rifle ammo. But that was actually pretty effective, man. I really wish I would have uh, gone into, like, sniper rifles or something. Or well, at least I just need to find a better pistol or more ammo for my 44. Ran out of for ammo for that one, too. So two of my best weapons ran out of ammo for. But my bow still works, so we're just going to keep, you know, just legolossing it up here and just try and take out as many of these guys as we can. And we're just going to try to get as much experience points. I did gain two levels, I think, there. So I put one point before Horde Knight into Penetrator, which helps me get through armor with both my bow and with, I think, a rifle as well. Which I'm not using rifles right now, but at least that's helpful for the bow. So, you know, I figured I'd put points in that or whatever, but let's go ahead and kill this dog. God dang it. Where, where are you, bro? I'll... Come here. <laughs> God, everything... I was, I was using everything there for a bit. Holy cow. There we go. That was an intense horde night, though. Jeez. At first, when I fell down there one time, man, I thought I was gone. Here we go. One down. There's that other one right there. Can I get him? Did I get him? Oh, I did. All right. Let's see if we can get these guys now. Last, what, two, maybe? Got that guy. One more. There's some others. Let's see. Where's this guy? Come here, bro. Here we go. Anybody else? Oh, man. I have a lot of arrows to pick up. Hopefully this gives me back most of the arrows I used. <laughs> that would be quite nice. I doubt it, but... Yeah, there's a lot of loot down here. Let's go ahead and grab it. Hey, there's a lot of arrows right there. The ones I missed with. <laughs> you can literally see how many I missed with right here. Just aiming right down to this one spot. Well, that went better than I thought it would. So, hey, there we go. Another Horde Knight down. Let's go ahead and gather up our loot here. We're going to head over to the trader, sell a bunch of junk, and just get ready for the next one. Everything It's going to be Horde Night every night now, so we're going to be getting this every single episode. I'll still try to do uh, you know, one mission a day or whatever, something like that. So these episodes should get nice and short now. Should be you know, a couple looting and just kind of managing our base and then straight into a Horde Night. And we're just going to see how long we can last, and I'm going to continue to make it more and more difficult. So it won't just be Horde Night every night, it'll be Horde Night every night, and on top of that, everything's going to get a little bit tougher. You know, zombies are going to have, uh, you know, we'll, we'll crank up the difficulty to insane difficulty, things like that eventually. But for right now, I think we're, we're looking pretty good. I think we can handle a few more nights at least, maybe, as long as I don't get knocked down like I did that one time. <laughs> that was pretty scary. Holy cow, if you saw that in the video. All right, anyways, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for checking out my videos, if you enjoyed it. Uh oh I hear something. Who's talking to me? Whoa, hey, you are. Let's finish these guys off, and then we'll do our extra. <laughs> hey, there we go. All right, one more. But yeah, if you guys really enjoyed the video, definitely leave a like, maybe even subscribe. I'm going to be putting more of these up. We're just going to see how long we can last. I also have uh, an idea for another Seven Days to Die series, which is going to be called Wasteland Warrior. And we're going to just make a world. We're going to do a custom custom world that's just going to be pure, just the wasteland and maybe the desert too. And uh, that's all we get, just the wasteland and the desert. We're going to see if we can survive. Uh, or how long we can <laughs> kind of do it like this. We'll start it off a little easier and then maybe we'll, maybe we'll make it a little bit harder though. We'll do Fortnite every five nights, you know, to start off with and then crank it down, but we'll see. I kind of like the idea of just trying to survive and then, you know, again, if, if I just keep surviving, it can get a little boring. So cranking up the difficulty, making it a little harder can make it more fun. So anyways, hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for checking my videos. I hope to see you in the next one. And if you definitely, if you liked it, leave a like, maybe even subscribe. And I will see you all in the next one. Take care.